as I was listening to my mum angrily complaining about the state of the country now that we have a Labour government, as if it wasn't already bad enough, I was thinking about how complacent we've become. How we just take it. We're happy to complain behind closed doors and you hear news programs riling people up and commenting on the state of the world etc etc and I listen to my mum watching her favourite GB news programs and angrily commenting on what they're saying and I think yeesh And they're all, everyone's complaining. Everyone is saying how awful things are. But everyone's doing it behind closed doors or in very muted channels like news programs where nothing ever changes. And no one is actually trying to get anything to change. So we know the government's rubbish. We know that when they were campaigning we know they're all lying to us. We know that um, when they say, you know, 65,000 more teachers, reduced waiting lists, we know that the only place that money can possibly come from is by putting taxes and national insurance up. We know that because there is no money coming from elsewhere. Where is it coming from? And we know that there's a, a large number of people who, like me, and in various other situations, are not paying tax on their income because of small incomes, etc, etc. So there are less and less people working who are paying into the system, the system which um, pays for all those things, which pays for the NHS and pays for schools and pays for libraries and helps towards council tax all those things which we're running out of money on and the government says well you know we'll, we'll do all these things and we won't put the taxes up and you know they will have to because there's nowhere else for the money to come from so we accept all their lies and we know that all the campaign promises are just jargon just to get us to vote for them regardless and then when of course these things don't come to pass as they won't now as they haven't for 14 years and as they won't now we just sit back and go well it's terrible isn't it sorry running errands while i talk um so yes complacency i'm back again and I wonder at what point do we just stop letting the powers that be walk all over us, treat us the way they do, openly lie to our faces and we seem to be very happy to accept that they will lie to us and that they are not transparent and that politicians jobs are all about making the money and nothing to do with the people whose lives they make or break in the process I know that protests or violent protests don't always achieve their aim and I know that we're seeing protests and all sorts of things going on in places like France at the moment where they have much shorter fuses than we do. We seem to allow ourselves to be used and abused on a continuous basis. Um, and we accept the fact that we will be lied to and cheated on by politicians and businesses and people with lots of money. But I also feel that if we do have some of those snapping points and at least demonstrate that we are genuinely sick of it, not just whining about it on a news programme 
or in a newspaper column and that we will do something because we've had riots in the past we've had you know Brixton riots we've had um, look at the um, the strikes we've had in the past I know that the minor strike we ended up with no mines but at least they didn't take it lying down we've had bin strikes and I know that we have you know doctors and nurses striking and we've had the odd bin strike so far and things like that but they're very half-hearted you know we're very easily beaten down by offers that we then accept that then still aren't any good and then we just go back to working again and complaining about how awful it all is so at what point do we actually reach A snapping point where we stop just accepting it we just seem to just take what's given to us we seem lacking in energy and I'm not saying that any other you know, political party would do a better job they're all as bad as each other I wouldn't trust any of them as far as I could throw them But the lack of authenticity and transparency and the open lies that we seem to get that we just accept. We accept that politicians will lie to us on their campaign trails. And that things will never change once whoever wins gets in, as is the case now. When are we going to start seeing that murmur, that rumble of actual discontent that turns into something that they have to take notice of because at the moment they don't have to pay attention to us we whine a little bit we complain on news programs we have a we complain to each other about it and behind closed doors but there is no real knee-jerk reaction to the system they're still doing exactly what they want to do when do you think that's going to change? When is there going to be an actual, genuine snapping point? Or do you think that we are just so very British that we will politely take whatever is dealt to us? <laughs> Let me know what you think about this. I'm interested to see where this system might go.